were there any freedom fighters from the far east region of india good question so what she means is what is colloquially or popularly known as the northeast region of india so in case some of you don't know where is northeast india or the far east of india it's here east of the siliguri corridor east of present day bangladesh that is the far east of india or the northeast of india you have arunachal pradesh you have sikkim is also part of it you have uh, darjeeling you have meghalaya you have manipur nagaland mizoram and tripura did i leave something out i hope not assam of course so this is northeast india or the far east far east region of india and were there any freedom fighters from these places of course there were but unfortunately our wonderful great historians have not really bothered to record the great deeds of the great people of the far east of india for instance there were people who fought against the turks uh in assam you had this great warrior this great commander great general named lachit borpukan who fought the turkic armies of the great tyrant the barbaric tyrant aurangzeb right and defeated them on the uh, on the uh, uh, the battle of the brahmaputra uh, i'm so that is one great freedom fighter lachit borpukan a great general great warrior a great leader of assam that's one example i can tell you that is reasonably well known nowadays then uh then if you go further east you come to manipur for instance uh, so you have the anglo manipur war in 1891 i think in which the the british fought the kingdom of manipur defeated it and annexed it so you had great warriors from manipur you, the the yuvraj of manipur bir tikinderjit singh and his great general thangal general they fought the british they fought heroically they were of course defeated and they were both hanged by the british in the middle of the city of imphal right there's this place where it happened it is still it is still there the place where this hanging happened so the manipuris fought the british two of their great warriors the, the great heroes were bir tikinderjit singh and uh, thangal general and of course from nagaland there was this lady called uh, rani gaidingliu right she fought against the british occupation of india in the 1920s 30s 40s thereabouts and she was given the title of rani by the great shri jawaharlal nehru ji so she was another very famous freedom fighter from nagaland and there must have been so many more but unfortunately i i don't know of all of them and also we know that uh, when the indian national army of the great of the great son of india subhash chandra bose when the ina invaded british india in order to liberate india there were two great battles the, the battle of imphal and the battle of kohima which were part of the second world war and lots of people from this region from present day manipur from from present day nagaland they helped the soldiers of the ina in a variety of ways whether it's by giving them shelter by whether it's by giving them food resources whatever they all tried to help out in the freedom struggle so everybody from this region it is known was trying their best to help out the ina of the great subhash chandra bose in its quest to liberate india from the foreign barbaric brutal occupier so everybody from this region did what they could they are all heroes but unfortunately their names are not recorded there is a museum the ina museum in uh, in moirang in manipur where is moirang here it is moirang so there is an ina museum over here somewhere here where uh, you have photographs of those old days when the ina tried to liberate india from the british so there were so many great freedom fighters from the far east of india but very few of them have been recorded i would say that there would still be records and memories of these great people i hope that the esteemed historians from the universities in manipur and nagaland and assam and mizoram and arunachal and meghalaya and tripura etc i would hope that these historians from these universities would do some actual research and publicize these stories of struggle and and freedom and the fight for freedom so i hope these things happen in the coming days weeks years months yeah
But that's what I can say in brief about the freedom fighters from the Far East region of India.